I took care of the water, Captain. Everything went smoothly. Is everything okay? No. The ignition key for the crystal! I can't find it anywhere! Without it, we can't even start. Oh, great. Calm down. Come on, just relax. The key has to be around here somewhere. Good lord, now I remember. Twenty years ago, when I got back from Baranor without the automatons, everybody was really very hard on me, you know. Captain, I don't really see what you- So I spent the whole night in the tavern. You should have seen the state I was in when I got back to the Bridge of the Crystal and... And? And then I threw the crystal's ignition key into the water. I swore I'd never set sail on the cursed waters of the lake again. Uh, can I duplicate it? There has to be a duplicate for the key. I don't know. At any rate, when Steiner finished building the crystal, he only actually gave me the one. The model might have the other one. I saw a model of the crystal at Simon Steiner's. Is he the one who designed the ship? Yes, of course. Maybe he could be of some help then. Maybe. Who knows? I do. So that's it? The ignition key is lost forever? Yeah. I'm afraid so. I'm really sorry, Kate, but we're stuck. I've made a complete mess of everything again. Again. No. Don't be so hard on yourself, Captain. I'll find a solution to the key problem. Indeed, I if will. you say so. I do say so. I have always found solutions. And this one doesn't even seem that hard. Because I did see the model boat there. And I'm gonna guess he does have a duplicate. I mean, what lock does only have one key? Or maybe he's got at least a model of the duplicate, so we can go back to the Yukol Smith and have a proper one made. Of the Steiner. <laughs> That's the problem with the uh, keyboard running when the uh, perspective changes. <laughs> you keep um, pressing the you're pressing the wrong button basically. No, can't talk to you. Lost your way, pretty girl. Oh yeah, that one. No, I didn't. I know exactly where I'm going this time. Kate, how are the preparations with the captain coming along? We're making progress, but actually we need some help from your grandfather. Is he here? He just left for the clinic with the artificial leg he made for the Yukol guide, Kirk. I'm minding the shop until he gets back. Maybe I can help you with something? Maybe. It seems the captain has misplaced the ignition key for the crystal, and without it we won't be able to leave. So as it was your grandfather who designed the crystal, I figured he just might have a duplicate. I have to admit, I don't see where you could get one of those. Apart from the model downstairs, I don't think he kept a lot of souvenirs of the time when he built the crystal. Would you mind if I had a look? Of course not. Here, take this. It'll let you look at the model close up. Aha. Uh -huh. Let's take a close up level. Uh, look. Level. I don't even know where that came from. Close up, look at the... Maybe because I thought look and model at the same time. Level. I'm back. 
This was the light switch, wasn't it? Yeah. Observe it first. It's a crank. Sarah said I can use it with the model of the crystal. Indeed, I can. Think backwards, eh? Uh, right over right here. Oh, a tiny lifeboat. Good to know. Mhm. Mm Interesting. But I have no idea. Yes. Does this have any clues? Mm, no. Okay, thirty. No. really hard to no. I need a clue because there's also halves here I don't know. I guess it meant to go, I thought it was meant to go down, but maybe it's meant to go up. I don't know. Clues, clues. What could we possibly have for clues? happens if we make it down. Then we can't use this, okay. Hmm, no we can actually. Right, 30. Uh, 
60. Ninety. Good guess as any. Straight at thirty, sixty, ninety. Uh, let's turn on the light again, cause nicer. Okay. Thirty. Uh, do it again. Thirty. You know, this is said backwards. And 30 was the last number mentioned. No? 60, 90, no, not that. Not correct. Uh, maybe I missed, maybe I missed some other numbers. 30. Lines me backwards. Rises, blah blah blah. So, so, so. Oh, 80. 30, 80, 60, 90. Okay. I, I missed the 80. So, let's try again. 30. Eighty. Oh, oh, eighty. Eighty. Seems like we've got it correct now. Uh, sixty. And Do it wrong. Thirty. God damn it! Accidentally. This is an annoying thing. I can see why controllers are. I would definitely recommend controllers. Thirty. Eighty. Ninety. No. Did I miss yet another one? It says 98, but 8 is not an option, is it? Or maybe I have to use this one? Because it's closer to a hundred. Uh, let's try again. Thirty. Eighty. Oh. Come on. Sixty. Ah, yeah. And then? Uh, I can't 
can't actually do anything there. Oh, I can pull it. Okay. Haha. <laughs> there it is. An ignition key. But it looks far too small for the crystal. Yeah, it's half the size. But we know someone who can replicate keys. We know someone who can make us a new key. The Yuko Smith. Now this is a difficult one. I assume I can just run to the Yuko camp and talk to him. And I don't have to go through the captain first to confirm that this is the right key, but it's too small. Because we've already established that. No, don't run into the rocks. Wait, I can't go back to the Yuko camp? This is where I first arrived. Oh, okay. Well, that sucks. Um... Let's go talk to the captain first, since we pass him first, and then go back to Steiner's place. It's all a wreck. Not really. I've got this tiny key. Nope. I can't tell him anything about that. So that was useless. Ah, oh, damn it. It's a bit annoying. We've already established a Yukol Smith can make perfect replicas if he's got an example. He's done it twice before. Uh, once with the key for the hospital, the elevator one, and a second time with the stamp, the Kraken stamp, uh, to get a pass stamp that would allow us to go to Falsam Hall. So, I'm not sure what to do now 
I'm going to go talk to Steiner's, like Sarah. And uh, maybe she can help me on the way. <laughs> just like, pause and run right into the window. This ignition key in the model must be the only existing duplicate now. Mm hmm so that wasn't very useful. Hmm. Well, that was also a super useful uh, comment. going to do a quick look around downstairs to make sure I didn't miss anything here. Tools that would have suited Hans. Mm, yeah. The leg is gone. So Steiner had the time to finish the prosthesis. Perfect. Is this a key making machine? It is a key making machine, isn't it? go in the big part. I want it, it's 50%, so I want it twice as big. So, 100? Uh, math is not my strong suit. F like, it problem I'm having is like it doesn't know the keys at 50% so 150% no 200% in order to make it twice the size or 100 as opposed to the 50 that the key is let's go for 200 because how does the machine know the key is only 50% of the original so twice the size can I close this yes The locksmith, apparently. It's 
So Steiner had the time to finish the prosthesis. Perfect. Okay, who knew we had a key copying machine there? Don't worry. As soon as Grandfather gets back here with Kirk, I'll tell them to join you straight away on the crystal. Yeah, I doubt he'll join us, but... What I meant to say is I doubt Kirk will join him. I doubt they'll let him go. Off to the ship. No, I'm not lost. I know exactly where I'm going, even though I look a bit drunk. Fantastic, Kate. I have to admit, you really know how to get things done. Thank you, Captain. Are there any other preparations to carry out? There's just one last problem to solve. The locks we need to use to get out onto the lake. They're shut by order of the town hall. You have to find some way to get them open. What do you suggest? The best thing to do is to ask Mayor Bulyakin for the authorization to reopen them. But just to give you fair warning, he's about as straight as a crooked water spout. So you mind him. Or you could just get a hold of some explosives and then... Kaboom! Hmm. First, I'll try talking to the mayor. Thanks, Captain. <laughs> 